Welcome back. The last step here is to bounce to disk. So let's make the selection of our file front to back. And we have one last thing to do with Maxim. Let's pop our Maxim plugin back open. And what we're going to do is turn Dither on. Every time we go from a higher bit depth to a lower bit depth, we need to make sure we turn this on. We'll explain why later. All you got to do is click the on button on the right hand side of the plugin. The job is done. Okay, we can go ahead and hide Maxim again. And now we're going to continue with our bounce process. So we go up to the file menu drop down to bounce to disk and we select our attributes so we're gonna make a file type as wave file stereo interleaved we're gonna change from 24 to 16 bit it's gonna make it a smaller file so it's compatible with audio CDs and we want to again just like last time in the earlier tutorial on setting up for mastering let's convert after bounce so the processing is done after the bounce is done and hit bounce now we're going to type in our Song title, let's label this PMF as Postmaster Final, and let's go ahead and bounce this to the session file. It's going to take a couple minutes to bounce this to disk, so let's let this roll, and we'll see you in a minute.